<laughs> when oh I can't, I guess it's a spoiler. Uh so I won't say it, but yeah. Oh what? Insert uh funny thing Lori did here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> walking by you. When she's walking by you, Gina. Oh yes, yes, yes. You can expect the same more of the same in the department of the dynamic we know and love. <laughs> the fighting and the laughing. Um, and the crying and the rejoicing and the comedy. The abuse. And the abuse, <laughs> physical and emotional, as Jean has pointed out in previous interviews. And we have it on camera, so see you in court. Um, and <laughs> and uh, yeah, more more of the same, but heightened. I We were both so shocked and... Uh, of course not shocked but excited that season two lived up to the first season we felt well i did actually physically harm her not on purpose but yeah no hannah's a very good sport (laughs) she's 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 frozen to death at the grand canyon she's you know she's um i throw heavy objects at her yeah it's Anything it's, to get the shot. You know? Anything for the laugh. Um, but yeah, no, it'll it'll it will pay off big time when she, Deborah finally <laughs> gets wise as to what happened. I think Deborah has every right to be upset at her. Um, I also think that um, for Ava, she kind of needs that to clean up her act. I, I think if she doesn't feel that, if she thinks she can get away with something, I don't know that she's really going to hit her own personal emotional rock bottom. So I think she needs that sort of jolt and that serious reaction from Deborah to really get her life together. They started working on this idea for this character about seven years ago. And seven years ago, if it had been done and taken to HBO, I probably would not have been at the top of the list. So I am eternally grateful that it happened when it happened and that I was there because it's it's just got everything. I remember telling a friend after I'd read it, I said, it's got everything. If I had sat down and if someone had said, write down everything you want in your next role, it ticked off every box. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Brilliant. Sorry. Lori Metcalf, wow, so funny because she's in that costume, and you just were doing a scene with her where she's that like kind of drill sergeanty, you know, road dog vibe, and then she goes back to her cast chair, knitting a sweater for her. Yeah, that's daughter. right. It's right. It's right. Knitting a sweater for her daughter-in-law, reading. You know, just she's so sweet and smart and cool. But it was so cool watching her work because after the first day the um paul jen and lucia came back uh to work the second day with like three pages of alts for her like her performance had inspired them to write three full pages of alternative jokes for her to do in those moments which was just so fun to see and read those jokes and like watch her perform that character was so freaking funny she she's amazing i've worked with her before i mean she's just incredible and she was almost unrecognizable yeah as weed physically i I mean she just she just disappears into her characters and this one was just a riot i mean there's a scene where i'm at a outdoor um garage sale and you can just sort of see Lori in the background looking at all the stuff and she saw a bowling ball and so decided to make a bit out of discovering this bowling ball and so she has it on the bus the rest of the episode and that was just Lori Lori yeah. glommed onto the bowling ball she's so good well you know and this is something that I think is true of both Jean and Lori is that people who have that live studio audience experience that creates a type of performer that is so special it really does because they have they they they're performing live they hear the laughs they know how to be uh they can be big for the audience but they can also bring it in and be small and it's just i think that type of work really just makes a performer so unique and so so incredible also too lori does a lot of theater her that's her background we 
we both share that, that we came from the theater. And that, that I think always gives actors, mm. you know, a, a kind of, well, you're, you're more interested in detail. And also you, you, if you're from the theater, you act from, from your head to your toes. You don't just act with your head and shoulders. Yes. It's just a different, it's just a different discipline. <laughs> When, when oh I can't, I guess it's a spoiler uh, so I won't say it but yeah oh what insert uh, funny thing Lori did here oh my god <laughs> walking by you when she's walking by you Gina. oh yes 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 <laughs> so, okay. thanks for watching eTalk make sure you hit subscribe for more celebrity interviews and entertainment news and while you're here why not watch another video I know you want to.